My, my campaigns have been uh, very issue based, uh, which has really drawn a line between me and my competitor, and probably to say, uh, you know, my, my, my one competitor, because I added, as it looks now, and from what I've heard from the people of Wazing issue, this is a, probably a, a two horse race. You know, uh, Buzeki's candidature is issue-based. We, we have a very clear manifesto. I, I think I even have my ma manifesto here. If somebody can give me a copy of the manifesto, then you can see I have a manifesto. The governor who is in the seat today and has been there for the last five years has no manifesto in the, in the public domain. We have hanged ourselves open to the people who are Zingishu to shred us and engage us on this document that we have put here that is going to chart the way for Wazingishu for the next five years. Now, the big multitudes of crowds that we are attracting in what you saw like Ziwa is because people have come to the realization that empty politics and rhetoric is not going to provide a solution to the socioeconomic challenges that they face. So they've realized that with the Buzeki uh, candidature, and an issue-based campaign that they are talking about enhancing agriculture, employment for the youth, healthcare services, availing water. This is what has attracted multitudes of crowds like what you are seeing in all my rallies. So I would imagine that uh, once I start implementing my manifesto, you can be rest assured that uh, my popularity will, will keep rising and keep rising because I'm going to deliver based on this manifesto. Okay,